Chikara's podcast go go your weekly installment of the Chikara brand of professional wrestling. With me, as always, is Wiggly. My name is Gavin Loudspeaker. Wiggly, tell the Chikara fans what kind of exclusive excitement we have for them this week. Wow. First of all, someone close to Chikara, me, has done something a little interesting. Super Meat Boy! Sound familiar? That's right. I am the announcer for Super Meat Boy. Download it now on your Xbox console as part of the Fall Feast. Hmm. And then it's coming to the Mac and also the Wii. And that is legitimacy to the We Talk Games podcast. And you want to talk about legitimacy? You want to talk about secret extra bonus matches? Well, here's one that you can get on the DVD, Must Eat Michigan's Brain, Lightning Mike Quackenbush takes on Green Ant. And it's next. Ring the bell. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight's wrestling action will be born and raised just south of Detroit, Michigan. Welcome to the Taylortown Trade Center. Welcome to We Must Eat Michigan's Brain. Bryce Remsburg alongside Gavin Loudspeaker. Surprise opening match action, Gavin. What a surprise for these Michiganders, Michiganders. who are here in attendance, yeah. catching uh, the resilient rookie, Green Ant, getting a, the proverbial wrestling lesson from the master himself, from, uh, Mike Quackenbush. One of his very own trainers at the Chikara Wrestle Factory, located in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, which is nine or 10 hours from here in close. Taylor, Michigan. You know what they say, though, what, what's good for the goose is good for the Michigander, to, absolutely. To be on the state flag. But now Quack, obviously a very submission-based wrestler, the master of a thousand holds, has, I'm sure, very various ideas of ways to tie up Green Ant. Quack and of, definitely with the, the experience advantage, but I gotta say the height and weight is pretty evenly matched. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Green Ant, oh look at this, look at this! Rear naked! Green Ant going right behind there with that hook. Trying to wrap his body all the way around Quack, but almost pinned himself there. John Barber on top of the action. But what a great crowd, our Detroit debut, our Michigan debut, big, big crowd here, almost 300 plus here in the Taylortown Trade Center. Absolutely, everybody in town right now to see Chikara. Yeah, very touching. They've heard about it, they want to see it in person, they've watched the podcast, they've watched the DVDs, sure. but there's nothing quite like seeing Chikara live. Right there, the two count only on Green Ant. So they came to this flea market to do it. But now Green Ant holding onto that leg scissors, kind of vicing the body of Quackenbush. Looking behind himself, trying to figure something out. No, shoulders are up. No. <laughs> Still the shoulders up. Quack, very familiar with the uh, wrestling game of human chess, Gavin, here. Thinking maybe two or three ahead here. Trying to stay uh, oh, ahead of the rookie here. But, however, what a rookie year it's been for Green Ant. All the way to the finals of King of Dreams. You really can't ask for much more than we, that. We saw him jumping off the anthill that Soldier and Fire Ant built on the top rope twice at King of Trios. Very, very impressive. Took Pink Ant to his limit, took Tursus to his limit. Fitting right in with the colony here in his first few months. Green Ant right now tying up Mike Quackenbush down on the mat, yeah. keeping him grounded. Mike Quackenbush, of course, a master of escapes as well. Sure, sure. A thousand escapes at least. If not a thousand and one. Green Ant with an arm all tied up though. Still got that arm in there. Quack able to get back to his knees. Yep. Green Ant's got to watch those shoulders. Wait a second, I'm going back for that arm. Trying to wrap it around. Green Ant trying to put in the blow. Oh, wait a second! Black makes the escape and then 
He could ties in a leg lock of his own could be there. Thinking a Chikara special variation here, Gavin. No, 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 no. Green in. Going surfing, I think. Or in a bit of a, a bow and arrow like like position. Bow and arrow type. Oh, threat. man. Hey, how's that for a bonus level war zone? <laughs> Yeah, I need a little bit of something. Hey, why not subscribe to the Catch All YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Chikara Office. The Chikara Office is the official YouTuber YouTubes. Ladies and gentlemen, right now, we are going to have a second helping of We Must Eat Michigan's Brains, this time with tag team action from the BDK, Lince Dorado, and the nefarious Pink Ant. Oh my, send more cops. Taking on the Osirian Portal. And he's laid up in a hospital, but oh, yeah, you know, after what Tommy Dreamer and Eddie did to him, and I, know, I mean, I gotta say, uh, I do love my job, Bryce, but yeah. I was looking forward to never introducing the BDK. Yeah, I know, I know. Well, I think we're better ever again. Here. I, I'd rather be this way, actually, not having to pop with him. Yeah, we don't have to clean up those messy grease stains in the yeah, ring. That's true. Let's wait a second. Now, Ophidian, if I am correct, this is the building that if you see that brace on his left arm, this is the building that Ophidian broke that arm in uh, about a year ago. So returning to the scene of the crime, so Davidian showing no fear whatsoever. Sure. Whoa! He nailed him right between the eyes. Pinky didn't even see that coming. Half Nelson's him over, only a two count on Pinky Sanchez. Osirian Portal clearly flying the flag of Chakara as they tried taking on the BDK in the first round of Kicking Trios to no avail. The, B the Portal was among the first the BDK ever, ever attacked in uh, Philadelphia. Wow! Two at the same time, former Campiones, the Osirian Portal, on the same page tonight in Taylor. Osirian Portal, uh, to the eye. Masters of teamwork, masters of the double team maneuver. It's Pinky Sanchez, perhaps the uh, least popular guy I've ever met. Oh, uh, now throws him right to the Lince waiting with shoe. The boot. Yes, of Lindsay Dorado. Lindsay Dorado already entered in this year's Young Lions Cup coming your way in Reading, Pennsylvania, August 27th through the 29th. The BDK's golden boy, as it were. Uh, they're picking him to go all the way in this year's Young Lions Cup and him looking for a tune-up here against some guys he may find himself in co competition with in Ophidian and Amasis. My scorecard has Lindsay at a point five. Okay, yeah. The, the, I don't think they call him the perfect point five. You know, I don't think it works that way. Amasis now using some of those. Now wait a second, eh? Funky Pharaoh techniques. Sending it back. Tagging in his partner. Now, makes the tag now. Ophidian now wants a piece Dies of the him action. Up. Splits him up. Boom! And into the pinning combination. Pain brush by Amasis into the pinning combination. Two count only. World class referee PJ Drummond in there, calling the action. Sounds like a plane's landing on the, on the ceiling, hear that? <laughs> it's got a helicopter or something. Maybe something is eating Michigan's brain. <laughs> Godzilla, Godzilla. Lindsay now working on that injured wrist. And he's actually, he's, he's not. I'm not sure about the strategy there. He, he's done the injured one. But anyway, there. Ophidian quick slipping out. Oh. Side headlock takeover. Look at that. That was a nice takeover Very by nice. Floats back. A Matt Wrestling Clinic tonight between uh, Green and Quack and Ophidian. Oh, oh, here we go. All the way over. He didn't quite have him exactly where he wanted him. Sure. Oh, look at All that. All the way back with a submission hold. Excellent submission hold. Lindsay has his hands here, but there's not much he can do about it right now. Ophidian, incredible neck strength. Oh, tried to face plant him. Caught himself in a push up. Oh, now grabbing on with another submission. Ophidian, very seasoned. Oh, Pinky Sanchez. Oh, no tag, by the way. These guys do whatever they want. Get him out of there. Gavin, we don't play favorites here at Chikara Pro. Oh, yes, we do. Except for our favorite fans, the Chikarmi. Absolutely, ladies and gentlemen. Make sure you join the Chikarmi. Go to chikarmi.com for all the details. It's that easy. But, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to say goodbye, unfortunately. We will see you again next week right back here for Wiggly. I'm Gavin. Take care, everybody. <laughs>